Hi, right, hello everybody. Um, I wanted to do this video tonight. Um, these are just some of the shirts I've gotten in from underneath my bed. Now, if you remember what my underneath my bed looks like, um, I don't want to show with that for now because there are two cabinets I put, two different boxes I put underneath my bed. One of them is my shirts you see on my bed, and the other one is for my DVDs, as you can see, which we're gonna show in the next part. Um. But that's by nearly this is just the shirts I've bought in over the years since um the very first shirt I'm about to show you will be in the in this video as well. And um this is the shirts um I got in at Hot Topic in different stores and such and mostly on Amazon, but they're but all of them had not been worn since since I bought them all warm once or twice before. And I got some mail missing shirts I'll show it also, but Let's, let's get started. Uh, this is a Led Zeppelin 1977 United States tour short I got from Hot Topic many years ago. Um, as you can see, that's the American flag and the uh, angel with the wings. Um, that's the uh, Led Zeppelin tour. This is the uh, Johnny Cash and the uh, Tennessee 2 at the Salem Armory. This is uh, when... This is when I think this is when Hot Topic used to sell, um, John, this is where Hot Topic used to sell, um, John Cash clothing, but not anymore. Um, this, this is the Queen shirt. This is just part of the 40th anniversary tribute because of the classic logo and everything. That's, uh, they used to, they used to have a bunch of Queen shirts, but not anymore because most of everybody bought them and there was no need to get them, so... Over here we have this uh, Bring Me the Horizon Spirit. That's the Spirit shirt. Um, I used to I was in the I used to be in the uh, Bring Me the Horizon phase with all the posters you can see from here, and there and it's now a Metallica shirt. I mean a Metallica poster, and uh, this is a good shirt, but I don't know if it's comfortable to wear anymore. I'll just go through these one by one. This is a Suicide Silence shirt. I I got this in an extra large, and I didn't know. I didn't have this. Now, most of the shirts I have in my collection, I didn't realize I own or I just have, but never worn them. So, we'll come over here. Um, This is my Disturbed um Asylum shirt. You see carrying a dead corpse, something a skeleton. And this is another Led Zeppelin um, tour from 1975. Yeah, I got two of the same um artwork, but it's the tour date's a little different. And we have my Undertaker shirt. I, I used to be obsessed with the Undertaker. You why used to watch wrestling. I still have my WWE Undertaker DVDs. I wanted video I wanted to do at some point tomorrow or something. And this is the Lamp of God shirt I was talking about in, in the other videos. It could have been on my Manson Shop and YouTube channel, on my um my Going to Ski and Tiny Sound channel, which is this channel. Um this is the Octopus. Um Sure, with the eyeball on it. This shirt right here is really, really too small for me. But this is the uh, Black Label Society. Um, I think it says on the back, it says, Pedal to the Metal Tour. It doesn't say what year is it from, but I don't know. Over here, um, this is a very special um, shirt I got from Boston when I went to see SummerSlam 2006. Um... This right here um has all the wrestlers on the front and then most of them on the back. And I do have a DVD of that, the DVD of the show. I got two different copies, but the first one um was was no good. And the other and the other copy I got from Amazon. If you want to check that out, and I might do a um another video about my wrestling DVDs. So this is just this is just the event Sunday, August twentieth, two thousand six. Features um the championship bout with John Cena and Edge. Really good shirt. And this is the White Chapel shirt that I worn before, but not that much. I think this is one of the shirts I wore in high school. People can't even back then can't even understand what the, it's neither the people who cannot understand the 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 band logo or it's just I'm um, a poser or some type of freak that just wears death metal shirts, but. Yeah. <laughs>
And then we have a Lincoln Park shirt over here. This is uh this is uh the shirt I got at the uh where I was at the Marilyn Manson concert at Fox Roots. This is one of my souvenirs. I went to the Hot Water Cafe and at uh the Fox Roots Casino. A couple more shirts um right here. This is the Motions of White Graveyard Chef. I do have the album finally. But this is just a shirt. I have two other kinds of this band tees I got in and but that was in the closet. That'll be for another day. And the last shirt I'll show you is the uh Bravin Horizons this is supplemental. Sure, this is just all gray. And somebody at my old job recognized the Bremen Horizon shows. It used to be their favorite in the in the uh new world for 2013. So that's a little video about my little T shirts I have underneath the uh my bed, which is my two um chests that I'm about to, that I showed you already. Hopefully you enjoyed. Um, I might do the same with my DVDs and my other shirts, but it would take um the whole afternoon to to take out, fold them if not and um if not check if there's any discs and then I'll show. Them. But that'll be it for another day. So thank you for watching this video and hopefully you enjoyed this little video, all my T-shirts and as you can see um I might wear some of them, but most of them don't might not fit me. So we'll see if. They need to be donated if not necessary thrown in the trash. So and also there's too many shirts I have, so I'll think about it. So thank you for watching this video. Hopefully you enjoy this.